Tichara. My name is Gertrude Oyenobi. I am from Asian Heat and Bise. I reside in the United States of America. My testimony is for my daughter, Chidara Merime Oyenobi. She based in the uh, UK. It was like this. On the 19th of September, our daddy in the Lord prophesied in open heaven. There is somebody called Chidera. Chidera, you can't walk freely in abroad. Chidera, you cannot walk freely because of your documents. Every day when you come out, open a chicken Chidera, you have been struggling, struggling. You can't even walk the kind of work you want to do because of the documents. I don't know who is this Chidera. The voice said that you prophesy for the release of your document, Chidera. Amen. You have been limited because of no document. You can't come home because of no document. Chidera, get ready for your celebration. Amen. I see your document being released. Amen. Chidera, we praise the God of Amateur Adventure. Oh. This will happen. This will happen. You will watch this prophecy. You will watch this. The day of his testimony. For his case is settled. Amen. In the name of J-E-S-S. Jesus. Hello, brethren. It happened as daddy in the Lord said it. But something happened. When we were jubilating about this uh, prophecy, the immigration home office came and picked up my daughter. They said she don't have documents. She came to UK illegally. She worked and she breached the contract of student of 20 hours for 112 hours in a day. It became a case. We started saying, Daddy has never prophesied anything, and it didn't come to pass. So we started praying. I sent the prayer points to my United States branch, some of the sisters I know. I called the prayer line here, Brother Christian and Co. They keep on praying. Every day I call them. Sometimes they will tell me, Brother Sister, stop crying. You are going to win the case. I kill in, in the prophecy. So brother Ebuka keep on every open night. He will prophesy that people that have cause case, they are going to win. I still claim it. We keep on praying. So they detained my daughter for two weeks in the detention. I had to call a lawyer from U.S. to United Kingdom. Then they now bailed her, keep her in the house for three good weeks. So on the 22nd of um, December, they called her to close the case. So when they closed the case, on the 25th of December, they now called her and gave her the documents, gave her everything. She now graduated as a master degree in United Kingdom. So I come to return all glory to this God of commission, Omechera Fancha, Okuchera Fancha. He has done a marvelous thing in our life. And I promise that if it is true, I'm going to come here with a million naira to thank this God who had not put me to shame. I say, may his name alone be glorified in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I you, Jesus. I you, Jesus. I you, Jesus. I you, I you, I one million. Yes, it's in dollars. How many dollars? Seven hundred. Hey, whoa. How good care? It's now one million. Oh. May God bless you and bless your daughter. We are happy for what God is doing. Are you not happy? Tell you, I can see I hear both of you. May the Lord bless you, favor you, in Jesus' holy name.